Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading Operation True Love episode 79. Uh, my baby's a little bit gassy and fussy, so he might cry, so I might pause in between. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. Sorry, I wasn't told what needed to be sent for cleaning. Could you come in and get it? Oh. Oh, this is awkward. What the? What is this guy doing here? Excuse me, are you okay? Wait, did he just... Did he say excuse me? Right, I'm wearing a helmet. Oh. No way he'd recognize me. Uh, come on in. Operation True Love, episode 79. Look at that closet. Oh my gosh. Um, sorry. What items were your, were on your list? I'll get them for you right away. Hmm? Items. Two suits, five shirts, one tweed jacket, two blouses, one skirt. Uh, okay. Why isn't he saying anything? Is he, like, super shy? Two suits, five shirts, one tweed jacket. This must be it. And this is my... Oh. A tie. It's not like I'm performing. <laughs> you just toss it away. Uh, take care now. Oh. Uh, that bike. Oh no, don't tell me he kind of recognize it, who it is. Huh? That's a place that does our dry cleaning. Why is there a bike here? It's so far from here. Hey, you need it. Hey, let's go. Oh, now that I think of it, he kind of looks like not many people are that tall or have those kind of perfect proportions. Hold on, guys. Hi. I thought he was going to throw up. <laughs> he seems familiar. Uh, what can you have them delivered by? Uh, uh, between 8 and 9 tomorrow morning. Could you lift up your helmet? I think I know you. Golden Goose. Doa wears that brand a lot. I'd rather not. It is you, Doa. Why are you pretending not to know me? What? Since when were we that close anyways? You're making it all weird. Oh, he was sweating under that helmet. Did you know you were coming to my house? Are you serious? If I knew, I definitely wouldn't have come. So you were the port guy. Oh, uh, port guy. Uh, the hell? How am I ever the port guy? Are you still half asleep? I mean, Yunnan pork. Was that you? I didn't realize you were this interested in me. So it was you. Whatever. If you're done, I'm leaving. The friend that Sue helped at their part-time job was Doa. He seemed flustered. I didn't realize you were this interested in me. Seems like it was a secret. I thought he was rich. Why is he working two part-time jobs? Maybe the rumors aren't true. It makes me wonder, you know, once he realized that Doa is not rich and actually is in a very poor state than he would, could ever imagine, like, Doa has a really hard life. I wonder once, you know, Yun Yuk finds out, would he 
take pity or like would kind of back off and be like a lot kinder to him. Who knows? But Doa is kind of jerkish, you know? He is very sweet to Sue, but he's pretty jerky to like others. Did you want to protect him? I'm fine, really. Let's go. <laughs> You're seriously gonna go like that? So they have secrets between them. Secrets I don't know about. I heard your hallways are endless. And your entire living room is surrounded by glass windows so the sunlight pours in. But your closet is bigger than my parents' bedroom. Is it true, Doa? My home that only exists in rumors. A mansion-like place I've never seen in real life. I guess it looks like that. The place everyone's been describing. Oh, so embarrassing. Oh, he's blushing. Riverview Palace. High-end, high-rise residential commercial studio apartments. The apartment everyone thinks I live in. The light reflecting off the pristine glass is blinding. Ugh. It makes me feel like crap. A year ago. The winter before my first semester in high school. My uniform was still new and stiff then. I moved to a neighborhood quite far away. Uh, you don't need to take out the clothes, right? It was a new neighborhood, home and school. No, we could just move them like that. But I felt comfortable knowing that I wasn't linked to anything there. I wanted to live in peace. I thought to myself that I should lay low and live quietly. But those thoughts became instantly meaningless. You ask him. What? Why me? Shoot. Doa. Huh? Do you really live at Riverview Palace? Uh. Oh. Oh, poor Doa. He goes through a lot. And I feel like each time we get to know him, his... His character, like his life and everything gets a little bit darker and darker. Like as much as I love Sue to be with, you know, Yunyuk, I'm kind of rooting for the underdog right now. Oh, I hate that. I hate that when that's that start happening, but ah, oh, poor Doa. Alright guys, if you guys enjoyed the way I read this and reacted to this blah what reacted to this webtoon feel free to subscribe leave a thumbs up drop some comments and i'll catch you guys next time bye